Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to make a hand-drawn text animation style inside of After Effects from the scratch. Even if you are a beginner, you can follow along with me. I'll show you everything in simple steps. And I hope you are going to learn quite a lot of new things from this tutorial. So if you like this kind of video, please hit the like button. It makes me motivated to bring new content for you every week. So with that said, now let's begin. I'll press Ctrl Y and there I'm going to add an effect that is fill and for the color I have created a color palette so just select this color all right and after that I'll create the texture first so I'll press Ctrl Y again and name it as texture okay and on top of that I'm going to add an effect that is turbulent noise okay now we just need to bump up the contrast quite high so that it looks like this I think 2000 will do the job and also we need to increase the brightness as well go to evolution and open the evolution option and there you will find random seed so what it does it basically generate random numbers and the texture generates like this on the screen but we don't want to keyframe it we will do that with an expression and for that I'll press alt and left click on that stopwatch icon time asterisk 12 now let's ramp preview here you can see that it is moving like this okay looks good now after that i'm gonna add another effect and that is luma key and there we want to key out the brighter part here you can see the texture is looking like this perfect now i'm going to lock this layer all right and after that i'll select the text tool and i'll type in the text i'll go to the text layer and i'll add animate and there I'm going to add position property also I'm gonna add scale and I'm gonna add one more property and that is rotation okay perfect now for the position I'm going to make this one minus uh, 15 and for the scale I'm going to make this one around 115 and for the rotation I'm going to make it around 5 degree click here and add a selector and that is wiggle perfect now if you just ramp preview it here you can see how it is looking i'll just duplicate this layer by pressing ctrl d and again i'll make another duplicate by pressing ctrl d press ctrl f and make sure that nothing is selected over here and type in text okay so then i'm going to just parent the source text to our main source text and for this one as well so what it does basically if i am changing anything over here it automatically updates that perfect then I'm gonna select this uh, text tool and just change the fill effect of it and make this one around 6 also select this one and change this one as well to around 2 maybe and after that I'm gonna select the main text and change the color now just ramp preview it and let's see how it is looking so far we have just built the primary animation but still we need to tweak a lot of things so for that i'll select the main text layer i'm going to add an effect that is roughen edges okay let's make this one 15 and sharpness let's increase that i think make this one 10 it will do the job evolution and there we need to insert that expression also so i'll type in time asterisk 12 again all right let's ramp preview it and let's see how it is looking so far okay looks cool and after that just select this text layer turbulent displays and uh, then just uh, decrease the amount to around 10 and change the complexity to uh, 2 and there i'm going to add time asterisk 12 okay fine i'll just copy this effect right click and copy and paste the same on this text layer as well now just ramp preview it and let's see yep it is looking nice right and after that what i'll do i'll just bring the texture layer on top of the text layers and there i'm going to add an adjustment layer so i'll right click new and adjustment layer noise add a noise effect on top of that make this noise amount 20 perfect so you can see that now it is looking pretty much good i'll add another adjustment layer so i'll press ctrl alt and y and name it as posturize time 
and on top of that i'm going to add posterize time effect and now change the frame rate to around 8 so this kind of style you can use for any kind of organic movement in your motion graphics project and title animation as well i hope you have learned something new from this video if you found this video helpful please consider subscribing to the channel and check the description for other assets as well so with that said this is shubham pramanik signing off and i'll see you in the next one keep animating keep smiling goodbye